for things like Facebook. There was a, a plugin for Firefox that was released recently, FireSheep, which is a really easy way if you're sitting in an inter internet cafe with Wi-Fi that you can look at what everybody's doing and you can hijack their Facebook login. So you would actually be able to post things on their wall as if uh, you were them. And so there was another plugin that was released by the Electronic Frontier Foundation called HTTPS Everywhere. HTTPS is something that you can look for in your browser. Uh, that means that your connection to a website is encrypted including your password. So if you're sitting in an internet cafe and somebody's running this plugin trying to mess with your Facebook account, your password is going to be sent to Facebook uh, as a bunch of nonsense characters that they wouldn't be able to use. The HTTPS is encrypting your data so that the, the government or the hackers or whoever cannot penetrate to your uh, information and cannot use them or exploit them for their own purposes. HTTPS is really easy to use. When you log into some email providers or when you log in to check your uh, accounts, uh, your credit card and your bank accounts, it's used by default. So it's something that a website provider can put in uh, to protect you. Now, some of them don't do this terribly well, where you could say, you could type in HTTPS and then it goes away. It just goes to HTTP, which means it's an un unencrypted connection. So HTTPS everywhere, where the secure connection is available, it forces it. And it's really easy to use. All you do is you add the plugin to your Firefox browser and it runs in the background. It's not directly a circumvention tool, but it makes your internet use much more private and secure. And in some places that might translate into censorship circumvention because people ideally can no longer see what you're doing in order to block it.